Hi everyone, C Chronicles here. Welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're a first timer on this channel, my content is mostly fragrance reviews, but I do throw in some life lifestyle content like in this case i'm doing a vlogmas video and it's episode two if you're returning thank you so much guys for joining me today you are appreciated um i'm i haven't been consistent with my vlogmas i should have been on episode three or four but i will catch up that was because i had some school uh runs to do and you know end of term things to do with the kids but now i am a bit free uh today i'm on my way to santon city i'm gonna grab a couple of items there and i'll show you at the end of the video what I buy so stay tuned deep in the shadows I know it's hard one foot in front of the other ah, So far is the echo Where do we start? You can learn to discover A million stars Here in the shadows I know you're scared Take my hand together We'll make a stand We've got to fight to Find a way Dare to fall To find out what's to say No more hate Just admit that you're just afraid Time to let go of all your fears and pride Stand up beside me Don't you Nelson Mandela Square guys I just got photos taken at the statue and look at these sculptures look at this artwork rather this is beautiful this is beautiful guys this is gorgeous okay and look at the waterfall wow wow it's colossal it's stunning so so stunning that uh some real house and butchery i'm gonna have to eat something because the restaurants here uh, i can just smell like the smell of really really good food try and take off the glasses deep in the shadow I know it's hard to put one foot in front of the other. Ah, so far is the echo. Where do we start? You can learn to discover. <laughs> That's the Rolex still. sculpture or artwork look at this guys stunning isn't it so my uh, battery kind of died there but these ended up being my two uh, choices in Chanel 
um i didn't buy both uh, but i bought one so i'm gonna do an, an unboxing for you in the next clip. hi guys see chronicles here i hope you did enjoy watching um this particular vlog i'm just gonna unbox quickly what i got uh from chanel rather show you because it's unboxed already i bought uh, my stuff not in my country so i had to open this stuff just to make sure that um there was nothing that needed returning or there were problems or something like that now um i also have to mention that pardon me for not being consistent uh, with vlogmas i know this should have been day seven day six or day seven when i'm recording this or at least the third one because what i'm going to do with vlogmas is i want to do a perfume review then vlogmas perfume review so i pers i actually intend to post every day but i haven't been consistent because uh, my daughter was wrapping up it was end of year we had meetings at school with school runs as well um you know all those annual general meetings and stuff so it was a lot going on and by the time i use I, I i i get home it was just too much to get into i do have the footage already most of it is in the um in my camera but it's just extracting it and putting it one on top of the other but after this i should be fairly um you know less busy so yeah i did go to chanel and it ended up being a choice between these two which is 1957 and 1932 okay so i did purchase 1957 but i'm gonna go back for 1932 in my next trip i would just i am just gonna go back for 1932 now let me just show you how 1957 looks like okay it's, it's in this plain box i regret like i said it's opened already because i had to double check to make sure everything is okay you know because posting perfumes can be a problem so you just want to make sure everything is okay before you take them away so this is the bottle i regret not purchasing this in the uh, bigger size because they had um 150 mls and then they had the 75 mls but you know i was skeptical i was just saying oh it's chanel it's probably gonna be you know so let me just purchase a smaller one and the difference was only i think it was only 800 or a thousand rands uh this one was uh 2600 or something like that and the bigger one was 3600 or something and i opted for the smaller one and i regret guys chanel 1957 to me is everything that Chanel number no. five isn't. Not that there's a problem or I don't like Chanel number no. five so much. I love it, it's a, iconic, but I find this a little too much. Um, but what they've done with this one, it's it's a very soft fragrance. It's, it's, it's almost like you're wearing a fragrance, but you're not wearing a fragrance. It's so, so classy, guys. Um, it is just gorgeous and it has a magnetic cap as well. So not that the magnetic cap is the reason why I bought it. It is just a luxe, luxury, soft fragrance. And it has taught me not to judge Chanel because, you know, I tried, I've got Chanel, um, I've got Chanel uh, Gabrielle Essence. I hardly use that one because I find it's too strong and, and all that. And um, I've tried Gabrielle, the original one. That one, again, is a bit too floral for me. But this, and there's a third one that I might actually go for. So if I do, if I purchase 1932, I'm probably going to buy Le Lion after. Okay, so anyway, enough of that. I'm going to do a full review uh, for you guys if you want to see a full review. Uh, the second thing is nothing new in my uh, collection because I always buy this um, soap, right? I love this soap. I actually wanted to buy number five this time because the way number five is pungent, I was pretty sure, you know, if I get the soap, that would be even more. But no, they didn't have, they just had this, you know, the same mademoiselle that I normally buy. So this is the soap. Let me just show you quickly. Um, the Coco Mademoiselle uh, soap. You know, that's how it looks like. So yeah, those are the two items I bought. And uh, yeah, definitely um, I, I, I left, you know, my heart stayed there or my heart is still there. I still need to go for those two perfumes, the Lion and 1932. But I think I'm going to start with 1932 because the Lion is a bit on the masculine side, but I might end up just, you know, buying both at the same time. So now, anyway, that is what I had to show you. I hope you did enjoy watching this uh, vlog. Uh, you know, we are going to do vlog 
must i know i still have about 21 or 22 days um that i should bring you content consistently it's not going to be just vlog mass i'm gonna do a fragrance review video on one day and then the next day vlog mass then back to reviews and then vlog mass that's how we're gonna do it uh, on this channel i'm gonna try to be consistent because now apart from organizing christmas and everything that goes with christmas i am fairly free so thank you so much guys for joining me i do hope you enjoyed watching the vlog um turn on post notifications if you haven't that way you will be notified anytime i upload a video also like this video if you like it and i do hope that you have subscribed so let's meet in the next one and stay blessed stay fabulous and cheers